Hey guys! Hello. <laughs> it's Sarah! It's Jessica. And um, it's getting closer to Christmas, so we're gonna do some stocking stuffer presents today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm buying mine for Alson. I don't know, are you getting anything today? I'm gonna look around, but I don't know. We, m I might compulsively buy some stuff as well. Yeah, we'll see how bad my money spending addiction gets today, so. Yeah, mine's pretty bad, so. Yep. Okay, see you guys inside. <laughs> okay, so I know we're supposed to be here for like Christmas stocking stuff, but we need to look at house stuff. It's very important, and we always look at house stuff when we go to Walmart, so we can't just end the tradition now. Also, I'm buying these earrings. And we may or may not have also looked at rings. <laughs> <laughs> what do you expect? <laughs> yeah, honestly. Okay, yes. we might be able to talk to Jessica and buy house stuff, so we will keep you updated. <laughs> okay, we just found a manager special. Seven dollars for an entire thing of Rubbermaid uh, vent. Thirty-eight thing. pieces. Thirty-eight pieces for seven dollars. Okay. You really cannot beat that. Oh wait, what's that? It's more. There's a fifty-piece one for seven dollars. What? And this is no. There's a lot of them. There is. Okay, we might have to get these. We. Yeah. You always need Tupperware. So. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yep. We're probably gonna buy those. Yep. <laughs> So we just found these pillows. They're on sale for $3, which is like backwards for you guys, but $3, okay? We don't really like the way they feel. Still might buy it, okay? I also Still am getting, a good deal. getting some paint, oh, oh shoot, no. and some paintbrush sponge <laughs> things, because I'm working on a project at home that I need them for. And this is also gonna be like a halfway prep for our trip to Portland, Oregon. Yep. And so we're gonna go get some Rain-X because there's kind of the stigma where like it kind of rains in organs, you know, like on a rare occasion. Yeah, so. it's, yeah. <laughs> so we're definitely going to be needing that. Yes. So we're going to go and find that now, and hopefully we'll still have money in the bank after this trip. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, first off, we are so shook that you can get 50 things for $7. Um, the other thing is, while we're here, I'm thinking I should probably get some... What are they called? Windshield wipers. Mine aren't completely, like, gone yet, but I'm worried if there's a lot of rain, like... I don't know. I also did find some of this uh, Raynex stuff. It's like $5, so pretty good price. And I also might get a cabin air filter while I'm here, too. The possibilities are limitless at this point. <laughs> okay, so we definitely found some things. My hands are very full. We're going to get this cup, and then this has the lid. It's hidden, but it's, it's there. Yeah, it's called a leak-proof lid, so we should be solid. We're going to try to find more stuff because that's not really enough to put in a stocking. He said no candy, but we're probably going to do candy, so. Yeah, because it doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We do what we want. some bath salts out of Epsom salt, essential oils, and then like rosehip and jojoba oil. And right now we're doing some um, chalkboard paint, like, yeah, chalkboard paint to like make it so we can write with it with some chalk. Um, and we did that by mixing one in one, uh, with a one to one ratio with some, uh, I used matte, but you have to use some sort of flat paint. And we mixed it with cornstarch to get that more chalky, chalkboardy feel. And Jessica's just making them look good while I kind of just get paint on it. So we will keep you guys updated. <laughs> okay, so we are painting all of these bath salt things that Sarah made. And I just wanted to show how perfect this one that I just did is. So, one second. Look at that! Is that not the most impressive, perfect, flawless thing you've ever seen? It's like looking into a mirror. <laughs> okay. Okay, 
Okay, while we're waiting for these to dry so we can fix the ones that I messed up up, um, <laughs> I figured we could go ahead and put all some stockings together, which might be kind of fun. So yeah. Okay, here's Austin's very nice Wrangler um, thing that it's called a thing. I got this um, massager thing, which you guys may or may not have already saw, and I figured this would fit. <laughs> so I think you <laughs> Jessica's trying to open this canned thing of pickles well, with her good. with her bare bare hands. Ow! They're not like those guys. <laughs> if you use the can opener. I'm looking for it. Oh, here it is. Oh, I didn't know we church actually had this. Thanks, Jim. What a guy. <laughs> I didn't know it was a church key. Um, this is apparently a church key. You use it to open things. Oh, and apparently I'm going to open it. We can get it in the frame. Yeah, I'll open it. Oh, good. Thank you. So, we're going to put the massager thing down deep in the toe, because I just feel like that's the best place for it. And then I think what I'm going to important? do is, well, I guess I'll have to see. This is going to go like this. Perfect. And then I'm going to put this lid in like this, just in there flat. And I think the gum, I'm just going to stick in there flat as well. It's not end of the world status. Okay. Bath bomb goes in there flat. And then we're just going to pour the candy in on top. process of editing mine and Jessica's vlog and I realized we never like filmed an outro for this so um featuring the Christmas tree and then my niece loves this little thing and she put a Christmas pillow in it for decoration I guess which is pretty cute okay um but thank you for watching if you like the video go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you want to watch more videos like this go ahead and hit the subscribe button um, if you guys want to know any like DIYs, like how I made the bath salts, or if you want to know any other DIYs, you just gotta have kind of fun doing that sort of thing. So if you just want to go ahead and comment below what kind of things you want to see in the future, we'd be happy to make them for you. Okay guys, have a nice day.